Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's me, Hannah. Today, I am an Adami, and that's because I'm going to be showing you guys a new update that came today in Adami Roblox. Before we get started, make sure you guys subscribe, give a big thumbs up, and turn on the notification bell to all so you can But anyways, as you know, or probably know, Adami came out with an update today on Thursday, but I would probably be posting this on Friday. But an update came out to Adami today, Thursday. And I'm going to be showing you guys the things that came. So the first thing, well, I'm going to just say, say the things that came. So um, I believe new wallpaper came. Yeah, because I think um, it said new wallpaper. Let me just go to the news. Oh, apparently not. I thought it said wallpaper. Well, um, new artist, artists, whatever, artists, well, not wallpaper, but, um, oh, it was wall art, but new furniture came out, and so far they look pretty cool, and the other thing that came out, also the last thing, is a new house, so there's a new house, and it is the Cricket House, which is 2000 dollars and i saw the inside of it from a video and it's pretty big but like um what is it it just for me it's, it looks good it's maybe not the best but i also i don't know I don't, I don't have enough money for it i think i almost have enough money for it yeah i have 1878 while it's almost 2000 but if i do not end up buying it i'll probably just show you guys like um a clip of it and what it looks in the inside but let's just go on and see some of the new furniture um let's go upstairs actually because i think there's more open space there up there and it does so first thing that we have which is 45 dollars is a burgers bookcase so um, let's just see oh and this is actually pretty big bigger than i expected it to be um this looks pretty cool as a book self, like, you know, where you put your books and everything, or a storage area, but it's actually made out of books, and that was $45. Next, um, we have the Pevis Wall Art, and, um, this also looks really cool. I mean, I am happy that now there is some art, and you can see a lot of the dummy pets in here. here. We have the giraffe, which kind of stands out the most to me since it's tall we have the mammoth or whatever we have the t-rex we have the skelly rex we have the buff the zombie buffalo hyena lion flamingo like you can study all your pets is so much Ooh, as you guys can see right over here we have the unicorn and the evil unicorn and a horse racing kangaroo this is just really awesome and dolphins i might as I might just keep that peeing in, honestly, but next we have To The Stars Wall Art, and let's see how this one looks. Ooh, this one looks also good. To The Stars Robo Dogs Head To Space, and it's going to say, looks, um, it looks like it'd be like the Robo Dog. And then we have Ocean Friends Wall Art, so um, this one's actually pretty big. And I really like this one too. It's like all the ocean pets. Then we have Bat Friends Wall Art. Hold up. I'm gonna just like, I don't know where to go. Um, Bat Friends Wall Art is this one. This one also looks very cool. I like how the shape is a heart right over there and they're hanging upside down. I think that's pretty cool. Next, we have Lazy Days Wall Art. And I just realized i haven't been saying the prices but i will be seeing them yeah i'll just say them now so the book is book case was 45 dollars i did say that the pevers wall art is 50 dollars to the stars wall art is 50 dollars with the verbal dogs the ocean friends wall art is 50 dollars and um bad friends wall art is also 50 dollars and lazy days wall art is also 50 dollars but next you have skelly rex wall art and this is also 50 dollars and this looks very cool let me just say 
Hold on, I'm gonna put it right there. Well, I think that looks really cool. Honestly, these dolls are very good. I really like them. The Scuddy Lex looks very cool. It's like a post, I feel like it would kind of be. Next, you have Owl Garden Wall Art, and this is also $50. And that is just very pretty. I think I'm gonna be keeping that one as well. Um, maybe the Scully Rex suit. I think I'm gonna be keeping a couple of these, but not all of them because I don't wanna be spending all my money. Then we have Camping with Sasquatch Wall Art. I have no idea how to say that. But let's see this one. And this one also looks very cool. What is that? That's a. I don't know really what that is, but you know, that looks pretty cool. The moon's really pretty in it as well. Then we have Imagination Wall Art, and I'm gonna just like, um, Imagination Wall Art, and it's an Imagination Box, which is also pretty cool. And um, that one was also $50, like, alongside with the Sasquatch Wall Art, that was $50 too. And then we have the Sheba Field Wall Art, and this one's a bit smaller, but that is just so cute. OMG, that's so cute. I love that one. Okay, well, that is all the wall art we have, and time to go on more of a furniture. We have for $95 tree lamp, and this is a lamp. Whoa, that is also way bigger than I expected. So here we have a lamp, tree lamp, which is also Gives a good amount of light. That's um, you can't change the color, but you know, just want to say. Um, then we have a um dog table, which is one hundred twenty dollars, and that looks that looks nice. It's it's very interesting and creative. I think that's the point since this is an artsy thing. So, I mean, I guess that does make sense. <laughs> Next, we have $425 long cat wardrobe, wardrobe, or wardrobe, whatever. And that just looks so... It, does, it doesn't look bad. It just looks very interesting. I mean, that's pretty cool, I guess. Very artsy, if you would ask me. Next, we have Frosty Refrigerator, well, Refrigerator, whatever. For um, I think it was one hundred forty dollars. Yeah, one hundred forty dollars frosty fridge, and this one it, it doesn't look that weird. I think it looks pretty nice. It's a refrigerator frosty one, so that's pretty nice as well. Next we have um toilet water bowl. Uh, I personally would not want this. <laughs> Here we have a toilet, but it's a water bowl. Pretty sure it's for yep pads and I, that's pretty interesting um next we have uh, next we have banana pet bed for 150 dollars as well and this one honestly i think this one is pretty cool i would have that one i would not be mad if i had that in my bed but next we have tire tire food bowl for 180 dollars um you know, this one I feel like it's less disgusting than the toilet one, but you know, still very interesting. Next, we have for $180 box trap bed, and whoa, this one is big. Hold up, let me move this to there. Wow, this one is big, and uh, again, pretty interesting. I mean, this is kind of like I, the box thing is cool, but like. <laughs> Yeah, that's pretty interesting. Next, we have... I'm going to need to delete some things so I have more money in the next one. But then we have Wing Cloud Shower for $180. And this one is... I think it's pretty cool. I mean, this one is not bad, okay? It, it is not bad. I am going to say that. Um, Next, um, I need to delete some of the some of these things for money um these are the, like one of the most expensive along with <laughs> along with this one i think yeah but okay whatever next we have for 195 dollars a moon crib um where is it oh right over here so this one 
This one looks good. Um, the back has a little bit more detail. Honestly, this one, this one looks pretty normal. And from from the front, it kind of just like looks like a crib. If anything, like an egg. But in the back, you can see some of the texture that would make it look into a moon. And then lastly, we have um a sub sofa for two hundred fifty dollars and. Imagine having this as your couch. You have like a sub thing for your couch. That is honestly also pretty cute. I'm gonna just sit on it. <laughs> it's just like, hey, I'm sitting on tomatoes, but that is pretty cool. All these things, I think, are overall very um nice and cool and creative. So that makes it artsy, which was the point I believe. And these furnitures are really good. I'm gonna just delete them. May I um maybe be keeping some of the wallpaper, but I have no idea which ones. I think I know which ones I'm gonna be eliminating. I'm just gonna uh, eliminate them one by one. Even though this one's pretty cool, this one is also pretty cool. I'm just I don't know. I, I don't know if I maybe I was gonna keep that bad one. I have no idea. These are all really cool, honestly, but. That dog one is just so cute. I also really like that one. How much money do I have? I feel like... I don't know. I'm only going to be keeping some. I'm maybe just going to keep one. But now I have $1,648. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to eliminate a couple more. Okay, so I could always like, buy them later, though, I believe. I don't think it's leaving. Okay, um... I kind of already know my animals, so, oh, wait, I just feel, realized the frost dragon, shadow dragon, and griffins, and frost furry, it's like flying up high, oh, that's pretty cool, okay, I'm gonna delete this one, though, oop, I'm on edit, okay, this one, then, oh, the dog one is so cute, though, it's so cute, um, this one is also very pretty, I have no idea which ones, Mm, oh, that's the old dolls. Yeah, that came out with a hat house. Um, this one is very cute, but it's also really tiny. The Skelly Rex one. Um, the Skelly Rex is cool, but I think I'm actually going to just keep these three paintings because I think they're cool, so I'm going to just keep them. Although, I think I want the octopus one in the middle. Not saying it's my favorite, but because it is the biggest i think they look cool there and then i could put um that owl one right over there it looks a bit weird but <laughs> yeah and then the, i just put the small one right over there just for now but as you can see i kept these paintings they're all really pretty i just only gonna keep the three and these are the winning ones even though this one's so tiny but it's just so cute but now it's for the house and i'm going to be thinking if i still get the house if not i'm gonna just show you guys where it would look in the inside okay guys so i decided i am not going to be buying the crooked house i think that is what it's called um let me just check i decided i am not going to be buying the crooked house but i'm going to be showing you guys some pictures on how it looks on the inside so you guys can know what it looks like if you are wanting if you want to buy it but also here how it will look on the outside as you can see this is the crooked house and you know it looks pretty interesting on the outside it looks pretty cool it's the crooked house but now here are some pictures so um the first one um i'm doing this off my memory but um it's like this is a living room and then the second picture it is also the living room just from like a different angle because yeah and then the kitchen that's the kitchen you know all these rooms are pretty good sizes just i just didn't really want it because i could have like spent some like time game money or stuff but i just didn't really want the house and then um there's a picture under the stairs because you could go under the stairs and then when you go up you have like the rooms and stuff and then you have one bedroom and then you have a, a bathroom 
And I think that's all of the house. I mean, it, it's a pretty good family house. Well, no, it's like a Mika will play in it and everything. It's, it's a pretty good house. I just personally did not really want it. But, you know, it was pretty cool. But, yeah, guys, that's all for the video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, make sure you guys... Guys, subscribe to big thumbs up and turn up the case and bell to also gonna post and comment down below your favorite thing about this update. If my favorite if um if I would pick one, it'd be these paintings like this the CB eel, the ocean pet, and the snow owl. Just all so cute. And I actually have snow owls that matches. And I think I have a CB eel and then I have some of these uh, pets like the shark and stuff but yeah guys it's all for the video hope you enjoyed make sure to make sure to subscribe and i'll see you next time goodbye